Do you have a thermostat that has a hold or a lock? Depending on what brand you have, there's different verbiages, but most thermostats is gonna say some sort of hold, temporary hold, permanent hold, some sort of hold like that. We had this question come in from one of our viewers and I wanted to do a quick video on what is hold, what is permanent, temporary, all these different verbiages, and what does it mean when you turn those holds on? First of all, if you don't know me, my name is Josh. I'm the host of the HVAC Guide for Homeowners YouTube channel. And in this video, I'm going to show you on a Honeywell 8000 how to turn that hold to temporary, permanent, and how to turn it off. The 8000 is pretty user friendly. I know some thermostats, it's a little tougher to navigate some of these things, but ultimately I want to go through what those holds mean. All right, we've got our Honeywell 8000 here. And as you can see down here in the bottom left corner, it says permanent hold. With the 8000, you can do a couple things. So the first thing is if you want to cancel it, obviously there's a button here that says cancel hold. And when you do that, it's going to go back to running the schedule. And in fact, even this popped up, it says following schedule. But if you change the temperature, then it will give you the option to temporary hold or permanent hold, and you can hit done. What's gonna happen is if I select temporary hold, let me go back here, then it is going to hold that temperature until your next scheduled time in your scheduling. So it's temporary. This hold that I just changed this temperature on is temporary. But if I want to go back and permanently hold that temperature without running the schedule, you're essentially telling the thermostat don't run schedule. Then we're going to select permanent hold. And now it's going to permanently hold at those settings. So that's how you turn the holds on and off. But let's go through real quick what exactly these holds mean and why you may use them at different times. So the first thing is, in most thermostats, if you even see this popping up, then you have some sort of schedule running in that thermostat. Someone has, whether it's you or the factory, if it's just been turned on from the factory, there is a schedule in that thermostat of some type. And when I say schedule, a lot of digital thermostats have the ability for you to set in that thermostat at this time, I want it to be this temperature. At this time, I want it to be that temperature. You can save energy when you're not at the house being able to run a certain type of schedule. Maybe you have that thermostat run the system a little less when you're at work, but go ahead and turn that system on around the time that you should be coming home from work. Well, the reason they even put these holds on these thermostats are on days that if you have a schedule running for when you're at work, what if you're off one day? What if you? What if it's a holiday? What if it's a weekend? Things like that. You can turn these holds on on the thermostat to tell the thermostat to either temporarily hold a temperature or permanently hold that temperature until you turn the hold off. In most cases, that temporary hold is still running the schedule. You're just telling the thermostat, hey, I'm a little hot in here today. You know, I'm, I just wanna adjust the temperature. I don't wanna change the scheduling. I don't wanna do anything crazy. I certainly don't wanna turn on the permanent hold, but you know, it's a little stuffy in here right now and you can adjust the temperature to temporarily hold for that moment. Or as we were saying, maybe you're off work that day and you're just letting the thermostat know, hey, you don't need to stop the system from running, I'm here today. With some thermostats, when you adjust the temperature, it's gonna temporarily hold anyway. Some thermostats, you need to still turn that hold on. And then what'll happen is, since it's a temporary hold, then the next time the schedule has a change, so maybe it changes temperature when you go to bed at night, then it will go back to running that schedule, as if you never turned the hold on to start with. In contrast, if for whatever reason, I've, I'm guilty of this, there are certain times of the year I might run a schedule for one reason or another, but then there's other times of the year that I don't wanna run a schedule. Even though the thermostat has the capability for whatever reason, at least for a little while, I don't want it running a schedule of any kind. I wanna set that temperature and it stay at that temperature running in that mode the way I want it to. And that is what a permanent hold is. You're basically telling the thermostat, even though it has the capability of running a schedule, you're not going into the programming and turning the scheduling off entirely. You're just saying, hey, until I tell you differently, Mr. Thermostat, I want it to permanently hold at these settings. So holds are just an added feature for thermostats that have the ability to run a schedule, to be able to hold temperatures at certain times, and then go back to running the schedule whenever you tell it to. So I hope that helps. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button. We'll see you next time.